Well, I've never heard this um, song. First time I ever heard it, and Dad do it, doing it. You know, when I was just a kid, and, uh, traced it all the way back to these old uh, uh, crank type uh, phonographs had the cylinders on them. Uh, so it's an old, old song around for a long time. Everybody does it. Everything I've listened to, everybody does it different. So uh, you know, I may as well be different too. I just do it the best way I can. Preacher went out a hunting his own one Sunday morning. He was against his religion, but took a shotgun along. He got himself a mess of mighty fine quilt and an old scraggly hat. And on the way home, he crossed the path of a great big grizzly bear. Well, the bear got down looking ready to charge. The preacher never seen nothing quite that large. Looked each other right smack in the eye and didn't take that preacher long to say bye. The preacher he run to his by the trees, and up in that trees where I ought to be. By the time that bear made a grab for him, the preacher was sitting on top of that limb. Scared to death, he turned about, looked to the sky and began to shout. Oh Lord, you delivered Daniel from the bottom of the lion's den. You delivered John from the belly of the well, and then the Hebrew children from the fiery furnace, so the book, good books do declare. Hey, Lord, if you can't help me, for goodness sake, don't you help that bear. Well, about that time, the limb broke off, and the preacher came tumbling down. Had a straight razor out of his pocket by the time he lit on the ground. Landed on his feet right in front of that bear, and the Lord won an awful fight. The preacher and the bear, and the razor, and the hair flying left to right. Well, first there's up, and then there's down. The preacher and the bear running round and round. The bear he roared, and the preacher he groaned. He was having a tough time holding his own. He said, Lord, if I get out of here alive, to the good book I'll abide. No more hunting on the Sabbath day. Sunday I'm headed to the church to pray. Up to the heavens the preacher glanced. He said, Lord, won't you give me just one more chance? So the preacher got away, looked around, and seen a tree where he'd be safe and sound. Jumped on a limb, turned about, looked to the sky and began to shout. Oh, Lord, you delivered Daniel from the bottom of the lion's den. You deliver John from the belly of the wheel and then Hebrew children from the fiery furnace from the good books to declare Oh Lord, if you can't help me, for goodness sake, don't you help that man.